to see them go on to middle school, inshallah. I feel honored because I had the privilege of teaching most of these uh, students back in kindergarten. I was that kindergarten teacher. And many of these students have been with us since kindergarten, and some even since preschool, mashallah. And it's such a pleasure and an honor to see them grow throughout the years. And I'm confident they all will do wonderful things in the future. A lot will change for them in middle school and the other stages of their life as they go on to high school, college, and of course, adulthood. But as long as they remember to live their life, life right and remember to leave a positive impact on everyone they encounter throughout their life, I'm positive that every stage of their life will be better than the one before. And we would like to thank all of the parents. We could have not done it without you. You are a great group of parents. So a round of applause for our great parents, please. We're so proud of our fifth graders, and we wish them all the best. To start off our program, we are going to start off with Quran recitation by Batu. Can you please stand forward? أعوذ بالله من الشيطان الرجيم بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم لا أقسم بيوم القيامة ولا أقسم بالنفس اللوامة أيحسب الإنسان أن لن نجمع عظاما بلا قادرين على أن نسوي بنانا بل يريد الإنسان ليفجر أمامه يسأل أيان يوم القيامة فإذا برق البصر وخسف القمر وجمع الشمس والقمر يقول الإنسان يومئذ أين المفر صدق الله العظيم I just want to make a brief uh, announcement at this point. Uh, we are excited to announce that uh, TIA has opened a uh, YouTube channel. And we need subscribers. So that's where you come in. Hopefully this week we will send out an email uh, with a link. So please subscribe. Please send it to your family members and your friends, so we need a thousand subscriptions, so please subscribe to our channel. Uh, next, we're going to have the homeroom teacher, Ms. Emily Skyadis. She will be handing them the diplomas, and uh, we'll, they will stand here for a quick picture, so you can take a picture with them. Emily, I'm going to give you this. Okay, the first graduate we have is Amir Kala, the first super scientist. He got his achievement in Arabic and Quran and trying hard in science. Good job. You can go right up front, buddy. Thank you. We have Mo. Well, sorry. sorry. Mohammed, with technology expert, achievement in Arabic and Quran, and trying his best in science. We have Khaled Brandon, who's a special friend. He got an achievement in Arabic and Quran and trying his best in science. Mohammed. 
Mahmoud Farah. We got above and beyond. We got excellence in Arabic and Quran and science genius. I have Hattie Hatcher, who got a mathematician, excellence in Arabic and Quran, and excellence in science. We have Muna with the sweetest smile, <laughs> excellence in Arabic and Quran, and excellence in science. We have Tetsneem with the cleanest desk, the excellent in Arabic and Quran, and excellent in science. We have Isa with kindness and caring. She's a hard worker in Arabic and Quran, and excellence in science. We have Rataj, who is a mood lifter. She has excellent, <laughs> excellent in Quran and Arabic and excellence in science. <laughs> I have Sophia. <laughs> I have Sophia, who's sharing and caring, excellent in Arabic and Quran and excellence in science. Layla, who's our social butterfly, she's excellent in Arabic and Quran, and excellent in science. <laughs> Mamu Nizer, who's a wonderful writer, and trying hard in science. We have Wassam, who's an amazing risk taker. He has achievement in Arabic and Quran and trying hard in science. We have Ahmed, who's a deep thinker, excellent in Arabic and Quran, and a science genius. <laughs> we have Abdaroof, who's a recess lover, an excellent in Arabic and Quran, and excellent in science. We have Miriam, who's the most improved. She's excellent in Arabic and Quran and excellent in science. <laughs> Amina, who is a radical reader, a hard worker in Arabic and Quran, and tries hard in science. We have Tylene, who's creativity, she got a creativity award, achievement in Arabic and Quran, and tries hard in science. Kenza, who 
who's a super speller, a hard worker in Arabic and Quran, and excellent in science. We have Wayam, who's a hard worker, excellent in Arabic and Quran, and excellent in science. We have Batur, who's a book lover, excellent in Arabic and Quran, and excellent in science. And Amir Awad, who's an animal lover, an achievement in Arabic and Quran, and tries hard in science. <laughs> Here you go, bud. a nice photo booth set up for you. Thanks to, to, thanks to our parents and our teachers for putting that together. And there's also gifts for them. It's a regular school day. They can stay if you like. Uh, I mean, we would like them to stay. Uh, before we uh, let them go, you can take a few pictures as, uh, as a group if you like. So we'll wait a few minutes. So if you want to take any group pictures. Stay there. Stay there. some pictures and then we will do the traditional throwing of the caps. Okay. Everyone smile, come on. Look at look at all these well, parents out here. Yeah. 